Hi, this is Asin. You are now watching Asin Math TV. Today, we would like to share how to find the Maryland series of loan 1 plus x divided by 1 minus x in a simpler way. We can first apply the laws of logarithms, so which means that loan 1 plus x divided by 1 minus x is equal to loan 1 plus x minus loan 1 minus x. And we can simply let fx be equal to loan 1 plus x. At point x equal to 0, 1 plus 0 is equal to 1. So which means that we have loan 1 is equal to 0. And we can now differentiate as usual. When we differentiate loan, we should obtain 1 over all the reciprocal. So we have 1 plus x. Since we obtain polynomial regardless in which Three, we can apply the long division instead of differentiate further since this is easier so we have 1 is divided by 1 plus x and we know that the rules of term of applying long division is always reduce the first term to 0 in order to obtain 0 we should minus exactly the same value which is 1 for this case so in other words we should take 1 times 1 equal to 1. When we minus 1 minus 1, we obtain 0. And don't forget to times the next term. So we have 1 times plus x plus x. And for the first line, it's simply plus 0x. So plus 0 minus 1, we obtain minus 1. In other words, minus x. So we should times minus x times 1, so minus x, so that we obtain 0. Minus x times plus x, minus plus minus x times x, x squared. So always take the first line minus the second line. So we have minus negative becomes positive, so we have x squared. So the next term should have plus x squared times 1 plus x squared plus 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 x square x x cube so which means that when we minus the next term should have minus x cube from here we can notice the pattern it's supposed to have plus minus plus minus plus minus plus and so on with the power increasing so we have power 0 power 1 power 2 power 3 power 4 power 5, power 6. So plus followed by minus x power 7, plus x power 8, and so on. What we need here is the fx or the loan 1 plus x instead of the f prime x. But we know that to obtain fx from f prime x, we just have to integrate with respect to x. In other words, we just have to integrate this series with respect to x in order for us to obtain the function that we need. When we integrate 1, we obtain x. Integrate minus x to the power of 1, where we integrate always power plus 1 over power plus 1. So we have 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. So which means that power plus 1, 2 over power plus 1, 2 with negative. And the next term we have positive x power plus 1 over power plus 1 and minus power plus 1 over power plus 1 plus x about 5 divided by 5 minus x about 6 divided by 6 plus x about 7 divided by 7 minus x about 8 divided by 8 and we plus x power of 9 divided by 9 and so on. By right, when we integrate, we should add the constant c. But when we refer to f0, we obtain 0, which means that the constant is equal to 0 or nearly 0, which can be ignored. Now let's obtain the Maryland series for the second term. We need 
ln 1 minus x instead of repeat all the process again we can actually make use of the function fx that we obtain we just have to replace x with minus x if you worry we will make any mistake upon the substitution we can actually make use of this cut line so whenever we see x we make a bracket so minus x so bracket square divided by 2 plus bracket cube divided by 3 minus bracket 4 divided by 4 plus bracket 5 divided by 5 minus bracket 6 divided by 6 plus bracket 7 divided by 7 minus bracket 8 divided by 8 plus bracket 9 divided by 9 and so on. What we have to do next is substitute minus x. And this can prevent us from making any mistake. So we have minus x minus square become plus. So plus minus minus. So we have minus x square divided by 2 minus cube will still be minus minus plus minus x cube over 3 minus to the power 4 since this is even number so which means that this will definitely becomes positive positive negative negative x to the power 4 divided by 4 from here we can actually notice the pattern this is negative 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 the next term must be negative and x to the power 1 over 1 2 over 2 3 over 3 4 over 4 next term 5 over 5 so minus again, 6 over 6, 7 over 7, 8 over 8, and lastly we have 9 over 9, and so on. Since we have obtained the Marilyn series for the first and the second tips, and we can now obtain the Marilyn series for loan 1 plus x divided by 1 minus x, which is simply the first equation minus the second equation. Since we have minus here, which means that we can first eliminate the exact terms, which means that we have negative x squared over 2 and negative x squared over 2 when we minus, they should eliminate each other. So cancel, no more. And so for the fourth, sixth, and the eighth term, and we should now left loan. 1 plus x divided by 1 minus x is equal to for the first equation the first term is 1x which means that we have 1x minus negative 1x so in other words it's 1 negative negative positive 1 plus 1 equal to 2 and we have x and for the next term we have 1 over 3 minus negative 1 over 3 so which means that we have 1 over 3 plus 1 over 2 in other words 2 over 3 and x to the power of 3 next we have 1 over 5 minus negative 1 over 5 in other words 1 over 5 plus 1 over 5 so we have 2 over 5 x to the power of 5 from here we are able to note this pattern we have 2x to the power 1 divided by 1 2x cubed divided by 3 2x power 5 divided by 5 so which means that we should have 2x power of 7 divided by 7 plus 2x power 9 divided by 9 plus 2x 11 over 11 plus 2x 13 over 13 and so on. As we can see, by using this method, we are able to obtain the Merlin series in a faster manner and we are able to express a lot of Terms. Okay, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Have a lot. See you.